Hello everybody, welcome back to Balatro Cryptid Modded Editions. Last time we completely broke the deck with the encoded deck. We just went absolutely infinite. And so what does the right button have in store for us this time? I have no idea. Source deck. All cards have a green seal. Cards cannot change seals. We did that before. It's just somewhere else in the list where I skipped through it. So what's new? Nostalgic deck. Joker and consumable slots are combined nostalgic... Joker and consumable slots are combined. Nostalgic blinds replace their updated blind. It's like the demo I did a little while ago. So, is it seven slots? It's still six. Oh my god, okay. Okay, okay. And the joke is not what I want to see, but hey. So we have no consumable slots. If we want to buy a consumable, it has to hang out up here in the group's pool. Um, I don't know how popcorn works when it's eternal, but we're going to try. If I play two pair, 900 points. Why did I lose money twice? Um... Okay. Not those. 900 points is less than two times. So we did like two pair sixes full of sevens. Or sixes and sevens. Well, high card might just suffice. 200 points. 200 points. Good. Why am I paying rent twice? Don't understand. Oil cards each give plus 75 chips. I mean, a foil card wouldn't be a bad thing right now. Oh my god, I hate it. <laughs> Start with zero discards. We can probably handle that. I wonder why this artwork. Well, we cannot buy anything. Free Mega Buffoon Pack is huge. Add a random seal to each card scored on final hand of round. Interesting. And zero dollars at the end of the round. Increase payout by one dollar for each Jolly Joker or M Joker at end of round. To the moon. All right, give me this and this. Sell this for three. Start with zero discards. Five hundred points there. It says on final hand of each round, so I assume I want to get to the last hand. What do I think a flush is worth? I don't know. But that's worth 500 points, so this will be worth 500-ish points. So this will win, and I'll get random seals. Nice. Really ready to be rid of this popcorn, though. You're done already? What? Did you not have five rounds? Tickle me. Very confused. Next base edition shop joker is free and becomes mosaic. I don't know if I can do 3,800 as we are right now. Uh, discard that and those. Two pair, full house. I would like to make quads or something. But the game isn't going to let me. Uh, 
Um, of course, now we get the extra eights and nines. I can make a nine. I don't think this is 2,000 points, though. It's not. All right. From the top. I will take a free holographic. This won't win, but it'll get us about halfway there. Well, the straights are playing themselves. Uh, I could probably make that work. Also, this. All common jokers are debuffed. Alright, well. I wonder if it will still be debuffed during scoring. Interesting question. Give me a couple diamonds because we get the plus 10 from over here, so. We did not get the extra delay gratification, but that's fine. Standard pack. Choose one. I do like a code card. When played and unscoring. Uh, we don't use discards. We do not use discards. Should be another, yeah, 600 ish points. I'm assuming that. Perhaps one of my stakes is rentals cost two extra dollars because I can't figure out why else I'm losing extra money right now. Uh, I would if I could, but I can't. Plus two hands and plus two discards means I get plus four extra dollars from this. Uh, played and unscoring. Let's do a pair of jacks. Have all listed shop prices. All right, we should be just fine. Show me the delayed gratification cash. That's helpful. When blind is selected, destroys each joker except M jokers and jolly jokers, and creates one jolly joker for each destroyed card. Well, it could destroy this, but not this because it's eternal. So that could be fun. Also, I could have used this to get cheaper stuff. But I want the standard pack. For hologram. And we'll do the program pack as well. Next defeated blind gives 3x interest. Or add glitch to all cards held in hand. Right, well, actually that was terrible because we're not going to get any money back, but... Never mind. Right, Jolly is here. Permanently remove a selected shop item. It cannot appear again this run. Certainly an interesting time. Now we can use our discards again. I 
I may regret the loss to my economy. Yeah, I'm going to regret the loss to my economy. Ah, well, okay. Interesting. Yeah, this, uh, this money problem is a problem. Play only one hand. I hate it. Or, you know, there's quads. Still the money issue. That's one tier three voucher to the next shop. That's a fun one. Honestly, I don't know what I expect to achieve when I can't have interest and we can't make more Jolly Jokers and I can't make more things happen that benefit me. This rental is crippling. Ends current non-boss blind without cashing out. Oh, we still pay interest though. Sure. Well, I can't afford things. Like, there's nothing I can do to save this. It's like watching a car crash in slow motion. You just know this can't end well. Alright. Let's pull the trigger on the reset. I guess I could have done that code card and see if it changed the game for me, but rentals really kicking my butt. Let's try and build up a better economy this time, shall we? Um, buffoon me? I'm going to see if I can get this to work. All of the suits, of course. <laughs> At least we chose correctly and got the one we discarded for. And a straight. Very nice. Even more money. But right now I don't need money, I need scoring. God damn. Alright. Oh, it was one of those clubs. It absolutely was. And there it is. Classic. At least... Wait, what? Oh, it was diamonds and hearts. No, it wasn't clubs. That's just me not knowing how to read. A classic foible for this guy. Six, seven, eight. No. Sure. Six, 
show me a heart. No hearts. No straights. God damn. When the game's not broken, sometimes it's hard to get off the uh, starting blocks, isn't it? Let's see if a glitched Joker can produce a wild, wacky number for us. I probably shouldn't be escaping as much as I am, but there's fun stuff behind the skips, you know? <sighs> That's just lame. Translucent card. Sell this card to create a banana perishable copy of a banana random joker. What? Give me madness. Damn. Alright. Sell that. Now, madness is not actually doing anything right now. Oh my god. Can I have a heart, please? Or not, apparently. Alright, I need three really good spades or seven nine. Nope. God damn. Excuse my silence for prolonged sneezes. Ah, uh, that wasn't a straight. Well, that is. Oh, goodness. Um... Okay. Give me an excellent brainstorm. That's an ex. I can't afford it! Really? How dare you not make it free? Cannot run, you cannot hide, you cannot escape. Must have room. <laughs> Thanks for the free obelisk, I guess. Wait, what? You're just making obelisks? Um. Oh my god, what is going on? Is a curse? Oh, no, because I replayed my highest because I'm trying to make my high card be high card something. Okay. Basically, I need to play anything that isn't high card in order. But I don't dare not full skip because I need to basically play as few hands as possible. So I want to play the most complicated hand I can. Right? Or, you know, I get I have a pair. So there's that. And it wasn't even remotely enough. Alright. No more 
messing about. Classic Bellatro, you shall not defeat me. Give me a diamond, thank you. Lose two dollars when I use it. Get two dollars, twenty dollars in two rounds, and eternal seal guy. Okay. All right, so there's a really good full house there. What I can do is I can just make quads in a second. Uh, this full house actually will be enough. Though this is rental and I don't want to pay rental on cards that I'm holding. That didn't work. Okay. Screw me, I guess. Alright, that's good. I want to get to the last hand. Oh. It's going to discard my sixes because it's a sodding hook, isn't it? Yep. Is this enough points? I suspect not. God damn it. <laughs> it's like it just doesn't want me to have nice things. Like, I feel like I'm making reasonable decisions. And the game's just going, nah, mate, nah. Also, I'm just going to stop taking rentals, because rentals hate me. still qualified as polychrome you just don't get the extra benefit of your own thing yeah okay diamond day no nope. fives and fours sure It's goddamn rental. Sick of rentals. And now I can't afford anything. I'm losing my mind. Amazed we got that full house. Give me like a polychrome egg. Some kind, friendly face. Sell this card to create a banana perishable copy of a random joker. I mean, I'll take you because you're free and polychrome, but... Abstract with six jokers will be plus 18. I'll pass on that. You know what? Fine. Mystic Summit, you're in.
This is 15 plus one half is 22. Make that work for a hot minute, I guess. Nice. Very fortunate. Pot of jokes. Minus two hand size increases by one every round. It's like pot of greed, but not what I want. One dollar plus 20 chips if played canned contains high card. That's hilarious. It's just free 20 chips because all hands contain high card. That's half of what I need. There's the other. All right, either we win this run or I go to bed crying. I would like increased hand size, so. Now's the time if there ever was time to do it. All cards with even ranks are debuffed. Sure. All right. Rocking the no rentals. This joker gains 0.1x malt when any 7 or 4 is played. That is definitely worth getting going. Alright, we have a run. I'm going to play that just to try and get $20 out of it. We didn't. We got 20 malt. That's a 7. I should have got rid of the discard. I'm dumb. God damn it. Do I think this is a straight? It's a club. We have a queen and a jack. Clubs come on the right of hearts, so... This could be the Queen of Hearts or the Queen of Clubs or the Jack of Clubs. And clubs come on the right, on the left of diamonds, so it could be. No, it couldn't be a diamond because it is a club. 50 50 shot. If I weren't playing this, what would I play? A pair of aces or maybe two pair. Damn it. <laughs> Alright, today it was not meant to be. I can't stare at it anymore. For now, thank you ever so much for watching. Hit that like button, subscribe for more, and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.